What is up everyone on YouTube, it's your boy Vidugo Vibes here coming at you again with another video. In this video, I'm going to show you the shit that I picked up in the month of May. I know I'm a bit late, but I thought let's just try and get another video out as soon as possible. So I've got five key pieces for you to show off today. We've got, um, I think, two t-shirts, a long sleeve, um, a jumper or sweatshirt and a pair of pants. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. Alright, so starting off with the two tees that I'm going to show off for you today is from a place where I would really, really buy. I mean, like, I walked in there just out of curiosity, and that is Cotton On. Now, I always shine away from Cotton On in terms of their price to quality perspective, um, but with this, I paid five bucks each. I got the basic black and white tee, um, but what really helped me, look, I'll just show you, I'll show you the white one maybe yeah I'll show you the white one um, you can see it's just your basic white tee um, elongated as well so that's what everyone wants nowadays but you have a back stitch man like look at that I don't know if you guys can see but you have a back stitch going all the way down the back along with like this extra panel at the top now this will cost you around 30 40 bucks from another company but this is cotton on charging five bucks for this like you can't get any better than that you have it's just elongated. It looks like the back's a little bit longer, but it's probably the way it's... I've already worn it a couple times. It's also got a twisted seam at the bottom, so it starts... The seam's supposed to start from the shoulder, but it makes its way down to the middle. Um, so there's that. And then the black one as well, as you can see, it's got the same texture. It's got the back seam going down the back with the extra panel across the back neck, I guess. Overall, just a simplistic, basic tee for layering. I mean, you guys know it's it's coming across winter in Australia, so it's getting really chilly, and I mean, it's always good to have these tees floating around for layering underneath hoodies and sweatshirts and shit like that. But uh, this looks black. It's I mean, it's a little bit washed out because I've washed it probably four times and the colors faded, but it does give that wash black effect, so which is good. So the next one, I saw on a website, I bought it on H&M, I looked on the website and it looked pretty good when I saw it on the website online, so I went in store in Melbourne, in the Melbourne CBD, and I picked up this destroyed black sweatshirt by H&M, now it did look better in the photos, it looks, um, I don't know, it looks too feminine, I mean I'm not going to go against like women versus male like clothing, but when I wore it, it looked a little bit feminine to me. I don't know what it is. Like, it's distressed as shit. Like, you can see, it looks like you've just been fucking belted and left you on the street and they just ripped all your clothes off. But, uh, I don't know. Uh, it's okay. I mean, I don't know. You guys tell me. I, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I'm going to wear it. Like, I paid 25 or 30 bucks for this. On sizing on the previous tees, I would have gone... I mean, I bought them in a large, and I probably could have gone a medium. So if you guys stick to your true size, you'll still get the oversized look. I picked it up at Uni Hill in Bandura. If you guys from Melbourne are curious, um, and this one I paid thirty, and I got this in an XL, and it is extremely big on me. Um, I'll still show you how you, I'll still show you what it looks like on, but I mean, I don't know if I like it. It's weird. It's just got. I mean, it's an it's a like fine fine knit material, so it's really thin. So you really you can't wear it by yourself. Like if you wear just this, you look like a total tool. I can guarantee you. You have to wear a long sleeve underneath. Even a t-shirt won't work uh, because the t-shirt will stay here, and like you'll still see all this skin. Now I did roll up the sleeves, um, but I don't know. I just don't like it. You guys tell me. I don't know if I'm gonna wear it, but I don't know. There's that. Um, now the two next pieces. Give me a sec. The two next pieces um, are, so I bought these two at Kmart. Let it sink in. Let it sink in. Okay. So I bought this from Kmart. Now it's your long sleeve turtleneck, right? So it's just your basic black turtleneck with the long sleeves and the shit here. So you guys have probably seen, if I put the photo right here, um, represent always puts the turtleneck and a long like a turtleneck long sleeve and a T over the top to give that layering drapey effect. Now I thought I'd do the same and I paid like five bucks for this man. 
five dollars, and so I got a large. Um, I kind of wanted it slim fitting ish. I mean, the large is still really good. I'll show you what it looks like on. I'll wear this over the top of one of the cotton on tees or any other black tee, as you can see. Um, I'll wear it over the top of this, and it gives that amazing, amazing look of the represent ish look that you want. The um, let's say the minimalistic dark high end streetwear. Um, now, price point five bucks, man. I'm not going to complain for five bucks. Now, I would seriously recommend this. They have this and a charcoal, but I wouldn't buy the charcoal. If you guys just don't want to pay like sixty pounds or eighty Australian dollars or sixty Oz dollars, I don't fucking know, um, for represent, you can get this and still get the same look. Quality won't be on point, but it's still wearable. Like you can see. It's just a black basic tee. It's not that big of a deal with the long sleeve and the turtleneck. Like, it's not that big deal. And I actually roll the cuffs as well, just so I can get that look. So, there you guys have it. Five bucks, size large. Now, the last one is also from Kmart. It's just, it's so random saying I bought shit from Kmart. I'm showing it here. But, it's a pair of, I don't know, uh, tech fleece joggers from Kmart. So, I'll get them out and show ya. I did the video on the tech fleece, and I saw these, and I was like, these aren't too bad. I was really surprised. Now, you guys can see, it's got like, you know on the tech fleece, it's got the really long black strip with the big pocket. This has the normal pocket, but it's got like, the black dots going along the side. I don't know if you guys can see. There you guys have it. And on the other side as well with the zips. Um, taper is on point, look at that, sick taper, and the cuff is what everyone always complains about being too loose, now this shit is tight, like it is tight, and when I want a tight jogger, I want it to be freaking tight, like the tech fleece weren't tight enough for me, and it didn't do justice, that's why I sold them and bought something else, which will be my next video, hint hint, um, these got the elastic waistband as well, and I got this in a size medium. I did want this to be really slim. And when I show you when I show you what it looks like on, it looks good. From coming from a Kmart perspective, they did a really good job and also have like a cut and sew paneling here, like on the knee, which is exactly what Tech Fleece does. Like the Nike Tech Fleece has this paneling on the knee that everyone loves, and this has it, and you pay like how much is the tech fleece? Like 90 to 100 dollars like for the for the track pants. I paid $17 for this, man. Like, 17 bucks for this, and the comfort is still, like, on point. Like, it's obviously not going to be, like, Tech Fleece comfort's up here. This will probably be, like, you know, just below. And you pay, what, a ninth or a tenth of the price? So that's the end of the video, you guys. Thanks again for watching. As always, don't forget to follow me on my social media, at Verdugo Vibes on Instagram and Twitter. Um, I've shown up the five pieces. I would seriously recommend hitting up, like, all of those stores. Maybe not H&M, I'm kind of iffy on it, but I mean, cotton on, $5 each, like 10 bucks for two basic tees that you wear every day, and that came out like sweatpants and turtleneck, it's a steal, man, trust me. So, without further ado, guys, I'm out. Peace.